DaVinci Resolve for noobs. One of the most common questions I get week after week is how to do things like picture in picture or split screens or video walls. Basically questions about how to put multiple different videos on screen at the same time. Now Resolve does have some video collage presets that you can use for some of those things, but here's what you really need to know. Every time you bring a piece of footage into your project and put it onto a track, that's going to be on screen. If you bring another piece of footage into a track above it, both are on screen, but this one is going to be covering up the one below it. The easiest way to have them both on screen and control their sizing is to go to the lower left of your preview window here and just activate the transform option. Now this is going to do most of the things that you can do up here in the upper right transform option under the inspector, but it allows you to do it by just left clicking on screen holding and moving things around. Here's a very simple way to do picture in picture and customize the layout any way you want. If you wanted to change the layout for the footage that's behind or underneath this footage, just go down and click on that footage in your timeline and and you can left click hold and drag these on screen however you want. This video of the pair of sneakers is behind the video of the girl because it's below it in your track assignment in your timeline. If you wanted this one to be on top, just move that piece of footage to a track on top and now the sneakers will be on top. And you can do this with as many pieces of footage as you want in your timeline. You can keep stacking them, selecting them and controlling their layout. If you wanted to change the crop on that footage, with it selected, go down to the lower left again and switch over to crop. Now you can left click and you can crop your footage into what you want it to focus on. Let's say it was just this dog and maybe the woman you wanted to crop in a little bit so you were just focused on the woman. Then you can switch back to the transform option and move them anywhere you want on screen, change their size, do all the things we were talking about before. Now there may be a situation where you want to stretch or skew the footage on screen. To do that, what you'd want to do is go over to your toolbox hit the search bar, make sure the option is set for all folders, and let's search for transform. And you'll see there's a resolve effects transform option here. We can left click and drag and drop it onto our footage. Now it hasn't changed anything yet, but if you go to the upper right inspector and make sure you have the effects tab for that footage enabled, Scroll down and where it says control mode, let's change that from sliders to interactive canvas. And then in the lower left again, let's switch from transform over to open FX overlay. Now you can left click and hold on the corners and really stretch and skew that footage in a different way, move it about the screen however you want. But it allows you to do more than just resizing it. You can really twist this into different shapes. But these basic controls allow you to do most of the things that you'll need to create your own custom split screen layout, picture in picture, or any other video collage layout that you might want to have going on in your preview window.